Yo, and what is going on YouTube, and welcome back for another FIFA 17 player review where we take an in-depth look at the 87 rated man of the match, Donny Elves. Now guys, if you have been enjoying the reviews, make sure to hit that like button and subscribe if you have not already, and also if there are any players you'd like to see from the team of the season, make sure to leave a comment down below, but guys, let's take a look at his overall record for me. Now I picked him up for 259,000 coins and took a massive loss on this card, but Alves played 5 games for me, scoring 7 goals with 4 assists. Now I applied that Deadeye chem style to him just to give him a boost in his shooting and passing stats, but guys let's jump on in to his in-game stats. He's got 94 aggression, 90 interceptions, 86 agility, 91 sprint speed, 91 ball control with 86 dribbling, 66 finishing, 96 shot power. He has that dribbler distance shooter, tactician speciality, as well as the power free kick trait, paired with those high low work rates, the three star skills, and the three star weak foot. Now guys, my first pro for this man of the match, Donny Elves, is going to be his position change. He is now moved up to a right mid, and with those high low work rates, he really fits the mold. Now gosh, guys, his pace. All I've got to say is he is absolutely rapid. Now in combination with those work rates, he works a gem up front. Always looking to get beyond that last defender and as soon as the ball is played with his sprint speed, he just cannot be caught. He is absolutely rapid and the thing is he just didn't seem to slow down for me at all throughout the match nor on the dribble so you guys can count on him to weave in and out of defenders quite easily on, with pace uh, but that's going to lead me to my second pro form and it's going to be his ball control and dribbling and what a Brazilian this little fellow is. Honestly having him as a right back card in this game is just laughable to me because honestly he could play anywhere on the field. He's so smooth on the ball. He didn't have any awkward touches for me in the game. He's able to ball roll around defenders or fake shot. He, now he doesn't have those four star skills but really with him it wasn't a huge comp for me. Uh, just because his close dribbling makes weaving around defenders quite easy. Uh, think at center mid he'd actually be an absolute beast with his defending abilities alongside with his ball control and dribbling. Just stick him next to someone like uh, SBC David Luiz and you're going to be just fine. Now my third pro for Donny Elves is going to be his shooting. Now guys stats wise his finishing looks like it would be horrid. But with that amazing shot power, he is crazy. And let me tell you, you can beat the keepers in this game. You just have to abuse the mechanics of the game. The power shot, the low driven shot with him are absolutely incredible. He can also crack the ball from range, guys. So just have a go with this card. Um, but this is one area where his weak foot really did cause me some issues finishing in front of goal oftentimes he would put it just a little wide with his weak left foot now another pro for Donny Elves is going to be his passing and guys he is awesome in the link up play at right wing uh, right forward right mid CM he's going to be awesome at moving the ball around and that's exactly what you want in midfield is the ability to distribute the balls here forward and you guys he is going to have absolutely no problem. Now my last pro form is going to be his links. Being Brazilian in the Calcio eye, he links to some, the likes of Coutinho, uh, Neymar, David Luiz, but also players like Dybala, Nangolin, and uh, Icardi. Now guys, I had a lot of fun using this Dani Elvis card and he really only came with a couple of cons for me. The first is going to be his physical. He is a very small player and up front that kind of just gives you some issues if you're trying to use strength to hold off defenders chasing down through balls. The second is going to be his lack of four star weak foot or skills. Now it really just made him a one dimensional player in terms of how creative he was for me. Uh, but guys since he costs around 120,000 coins on Xbox at this moment in time do I think he's worth the coins? Honestly guys if you're using him as a right mid he'd do great things bombing up and down the field either at that position or CM uh, on 7 chem. He has the ability to intercept the ball, turn the play, win the ball back uh, with his defending but at right wing or right forward I just didn't think he had the attacking mindset that you would want especially that you would get in uh, comparison to his Calcio A counterparts Mohamed Salah or uh, Juan Cuadrado but guys that's going to bring us to a close on a review of the 87 rated man of the match Danny Elves if you have any players you'd like for me to review on the channel make sure to leave a comment down below and I'll make my way through them and as always guys thanks for stopping by and if you haven't already hit that like and subscribe button because what else you gonna do I'll check you guys later